everyone, Engram here and welcome to another The Sims Mobile video. The Halloween Haunt event is now live. Let's get started. Get limited time rewards, pick your prizes and earn milestone rewards like the Undead Bride costume. Ooh. Collect candy corn from Halloween events, llama zoom tasks and a special quest. Plus Izzy's fashion shop is more likely to give out costumes. Nice. I need to get right onto this, so let's go. The Halloween Haunt event is here. Earn candy corn, which will then help you to collect costumes and decorations. And I am living for that cauldron. Oh man. And then with that, you unlock fantastic prizes. This sounds like it's kind of maybe like that ASOS event. So where you're able to choose your prizes. Let's get into it and check it out. And oh yes. We are able to do this like the ASOS event. Oh, okay, that's handy. You've got like a, I'm pointing to the screen, which does not help you. However, it looks like we have a meter that shows us how many candy corns we have earned and how far along the prize, uh, I don't even know, <laughs> the prize, um, progress yeah it's a progress bar that's the word how far along the price progress bar you are in order to get to that costume right at the end it looks like a bunch of these items are very similar if not exactly the same as ones from the sims 4 spooky stuff pack and oh my god the cat makeup and you get the, okay, you get Winterberg armor and helmet. So I guess that's the knight costume from uh, whatever Windenberg came with. <laughs> Can do jumpsuit. Oh, wow, that's nice with the headwear. That's that's from bowling stuff. The horse mask. Oh, we don't have that in The Sims 4. Can we please have that, Sims team? Please. All right. And then you've got the rug, pumpkin mask, teacher's makeup oh my gosh yeah that looks like spooky stuff uh furniture as well oh i am so keen to unlock all of these i am going to be working extra hard okay what's in the activities halloween begins so potential rewards is that <gasps> that kind of looks like um a table with a scrying orb and uh, candles and all of that. Um, oh, okay. And then there's home for Halloween event, costume construction and Halloween haunt. So those are all, I keep calling things events, but they're quests that you can do. Um, what else is there? Okay. There's the Halloween bonus bundle, limited time offer. This bundle includes an exclusive costume which looks like it's a unicorn oh my god and a candy cauldron which is so cute along with other goodies to help you to progress through the halloween haunt event quickly to earn more prizes the candy cauldron will only dispense candy during this event right and that's available for nine days and 11 hours actually i forgot to check how long the um the event is um let's okay so that's this there so it's about nine and a half days right fabi you can find it there in the top right hand corner of your main screen and the quest button is asking for my attention so let's have a quick looky look okay it's a 24 part quest. Complete the quest and earn the Mystics table. Okay. So that's what we get for getting through those 24 parts. Part one of 24, set Halloween in motion by completing this ritual. Earn 31 simoleons. All right, time to get right onto that. Part two, a chilling search. Don't get cold feet. Let's just find some treats. Complete search for treats at a fridge. Let's do that then, because this should be nice and quick. The other one was a bit longer. I had to complete a hobby event, which is why I skipped right over. 
next it's going to be oh i'm burning candy corns too gaze into a mirror and see the costume you're meant to wear nice Oh, and I have earned a reward. Collect 3650 more candy corn to earn the next reward. Nice, I got the candy bowl. Oh, check your inventory for the candy bowl. Thanks, in the home inventory and I have so much stuff in here. Right, so I have placed it here and the candy bowl gives you 125 candy corns and I can tap on it to collect the candy corns. All right, check back often to collect candy corn from your candy bowl. A candy cauldron fills with even more candy corn and it's pointing me over here, which presumably has, yeah, the cauldron in here to purchase. Right. Supper. What a treat. We just got extra candy corn for the Halloween haunt. Nice. Let's go spend some candy corn on some spooky prizes. Tap on the Halloween haunt icon to check out the prizes. Okay, that's we're in the rewards tab. We have enough candy corn to buy something. We have 625. So we can basically buy the fairy makeup. I think the rest of it is more expensive than 625. Yep, yeah, yep, yep, yep. The makeup, the cauldron, everything is okay. But we could get one of the rugs. Let's let's grab the fairy makeup i kind of like it i really quite kind of like it so let's grab the fairy makeup it's also the cheapest <laughs> and all right here we go now we can go <clears throat> excuse me and look in the mirror visualize your costume that's nice and quick hopefully yep there we go right Part 14, gags or goodies. Treats in exchange for not pranking. What an odd tradition. Say trick or treat to a sim. All right, and you have to do that five times. Now that that's completed, let's move on to part five. A small effort that brings you one step closer to Halloween. Complete an event. Uh, I completed yeah. an event. <laughs> in fact, I mastered a hobby and part six is what would you like to wear for halloween change your appearance and moving right along a haunting home part seven halloween is life when you bring it into your home complete the home for halloween event that looks like that's going to be a lot of fun hopefully with new animations i shall get right onto that let's have a look oh home for halloween and costuming oh wow halloween haunt okay okay so let's speed that up with going faster with some cupcakes and let's see what some of the animations are choose resting place that's on the couch obviously and then we have on the television watch halloween prank videos oh well, okay, what's on the radio? Dance like the undead. Oh my god, Thriller. He is doing the dance from Thriller. That is so cute. Okay, what's on the bookshelf? Read Halloween fiction. So he's just, um, yeah, just reading a book there. Okay. Then we have an interaction on the chair. Yeah, it's all chair ones, which is choose resting place, which is like on the couch. There's something on the yoga mats. So let's check that out. What's on the yoga mats? A bend to the will of Halloween. Oh, I like his workout clothes. What's he going to do? Okay, he is just going to do the downward dog, I think. Okay. Baby. I'm confident enough to try a risky action. I think I saw something on a sim. Here we go. Let's have a look. Take a Halloween self-fee is one risky one. And the other one is critique costume authenticity. Oh, okay. Let's, let's do this one. It looks like it's got a much higher chance. And 
All right. <laughs> so awesome. They did, took a selfie. Oh, this is so much fun. All right, I shall complete the rest of the, the event. Oh, hang on. There's something on these. Bask in the glow and water the pumpkin tree. That was on the pumpkin tree. Nice. So it seems like we also have additional interactions on the Head Start event items. Pretty costume authenticity. Let's see how it goes, whether it fails or whether we... Oh my God. Oh, and that went well. And she looks so awesome. Oh my goodness. That is so fantastic. Right. Let me just finish this off without squeeing about it anymore. Having completed that, it's part time to move on to part eight, decorating your home with jacko lanterns and gravestones. So we need to open a creepy coffin. And in order to do that, we tap on the pumpkin in the top right hand corner. And over here in the rewards section, we tap view under the creepy coffin and we can spend 100. So it looks like we also get random rewards as well. Here we go, got a coffin and we tap on that and we get to claim a cranky jack-o'-lantern. Next part, as sticky as candy. I wish we could wear Halloween costumes all year round. Give stickers to five sims. You got it, plant it. Your costume is looking so good it's scary. Complete the costume construction event. In order to do the costume construction event, we go here into the activities tab and we start the costume construction event. For that, we are going to go to Market Square. And let's speed that up with cupcakes just so that we get through it a little bit quicker. Let's check out some of these interactions. Use thick red for spooky effect. All right, these are so cute. I think the animations on this will be mostly standard, but let's check out some of the interactions. So you get admire the headless horror. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. It's on the mannequin. Design spooky patterns. Consider costume themes. And on the shoe rack, find the right shoes for the costume. On another sim, it's assist in Halloween costume fitting. Boo. Share spooky stories and trick or treat. Let's boo. I'm actually keen to see that. Okay, he's just talking. Right. No, we're not going to retire just yet. Okay, and this is on a painting. It's on a painting. Okay. And that is consider butterfly costumes. Oh, and it's a butterfly painting. Oh, wow. I wonder if it does that for any other paintings. That's really gosh darn cute. I'm gonna get through that and we'll be right back with the next part. Radio. now that that's complete, time for part 11. Is it a costume party? It doesn't matter, let's have a blast. Earn three stars at a party. For a rainy day, part 12. Halloween is best celebrated with simoleons in your pocket. Earn 650 simoleons. Part 13, Frights and Delights, a haunting set of tasks, but all in the spirit of Halloween. Complete any five events. Oh boy. And here we go, Soiree in the Shadows, part 14. You can collect many of the decorations you'll see in the downtown area. Complete the Halloween haunt event in downtown. Let's have a look at some of the interactions. Ooh. Okay, oh, here we go. Oh, wow. Okay, the area is actually decorated with all sorts of things. I'm having trouble oh, rotating it. I don't know, possibly just me. There's like a giant pumpkin in the town center. There's um, these cute little uh, gravestones. That's the word I was looking for. There is that. Oh, can we interact with it? No. Okay, that's that uh, ultimate reward table. You can see the cauldron here. There's a bar. What do we do at the bar? Mixed drinks. All right. And then we've got the rugs, which is the skeleton rug, the bat rug, and the pumpkin rug. Ooh, there's like a gargoyle. 
Oh man, that's awesome. Ponda Gargoyles history. And there's like a whole lot of these cute little pumpkin dudes. Look at them all. Look at them. Right, I'll get on to finishing that rather than just kind of repeating. Hey, look at it, look at it, you guys. And uh, we'll get on with the next part. Moving right along, let's get on to part 15. Chills and thrills. Eat candy all day and we'll send prizes your way. Complete all Llama Zoom tasks and collect rewards. And then we have a dressed up home, part 16. In a way, decorating is a putting your house in a Halloween costume. Right, complete the home for Halloween event. Part 17, collection of confections. Think of everything you can earn with all that candy corn. Collect 600 candy corn. Part 18, bewitching business. Carve out a little time to celebrate Halloween. Complete all Llama Zoom tasks and collect rewards. Ooh, and that one got us the Grapestone Trio. We have to collect 3,724 more candy to earn the next reward. Let's keep going. What's the next part? Part 19, finishing touches. One can best experience Halloween with a perfect costume. Complete the costume construction event. Part 20, eat, drink, and be scary. Let's celebrate Halloween with some monstrous rewards. Complete all Llama Zoom tasks and collect the rewards. Part 21, sweet treats. Have you been trading your candy corn for awesome prizes? Collect candy corn or 1,200 of it. Part 22, a lark in the dark. The downtown looks pretty spooky, but not enough to keep you away. Complete the Halloween haunt event in downtown. Part 23, a terrifying task. Halloween is best celebrated by collecting all of the prizes. Complete yet another llama zoom. And finally, part 24, sugar overload. May your Halloween be filled with fond memories and loads of candy. Collect another 1200 candy corn. And with that, I have completed all 24 parts and I got the bonus quest reward or quest bonus reward, uh, which is the Mystics Table. Right, let me just uh, take Cameron home and we'll check out those items. Let me show you the items that I have unlocked so far, which is the trio of gravestones. I have, as you can see, a pumpkin that I got from one of the coffins. And then we have the two gargoyles. Um, yeah, for whatever reason, rather than unlocking just one, it unlocked two. And um, then there is this table, the mystical table. At the table, we can peer into the future. Ooh nice what else can we do we can receive premonitions which has the same sort of um animation and that appears to have broken up to just two uses and then we can test clairvoyance Okay, that's a cute little animation. It seems that it does have that one animation, but that's really cute. Um, with the gargoyle, we can admire the sculptor's skill or just view. Let's admire. Ooh, it kind of gives them a bit of a scared reaction. Any others? Make eye contact. Ooh, okay. Anything with the pumpkin? Applaud oh. artistry. Oh. Okay. With the... Oops. I clicked on a sim rather than on the trio of Here Lies Bone Hilda and a view Gravestone Trio. So that's those three items. My... Uh, candy corn bowl is um, still slowly filling. I've got another nine hours before it becomes full and I could collect more of those candy corns. 
This is probably a lot longer than I normally would make a mobile video, but I wanted to get through the whole quest line and show you everything that becomes unlocked and what the quests are. Thanks for hanging out with me. Please like, subscribe, leave a comment, all that good stuff. Be awfully good to each other and I'll see you in my next video.